going to be making this really cute DIY tray. Makeup tray. <laughs> it's the furthest DIY project. Sorry if I'm talking really loud. It's because the air conditioning is on and obviously the music is up. So what you're going to do is get these pans. I got these two pans at the dollar store for a dollar each. And also this candlestick. I'm at the dollar store for a dollar. So this literally cost me three dollars. Um, so what I'm going to be doing is just taking some mint green in the paint in the shade of Seaside, which I got from AC Moore for only $1.99, and it wasn't even on sale, so imagine if it was. What I'm going to be doing is, if you guys can already see, I took a green marker and traced the candlestick so I know where not to put the paint. So what I'm going to be doing is just painting my whole entire pan and going around the circle, obviously, so I don't waste my paint in the middle doing is just taking my paint and putting some around the pan. I'm not going to be painting the side of the pan, just the inside of the pan. So taking my brush, I'm just painting it. Um, you can do any color you like. You can also spray paint it. Um, I sadly don't have any spray paint besides the pink one, but I kind of don't want it to be pink. I want it to be a loud, like, pastel color, exactly like this one right here. So pretty self-explanatory. Do as many coats as you like. I can't, I'm not there with, there with you. But um, do whatever you feel is right. You can do patterns or fell or whatever. I mean, this is your project. I think I put too much paint. Yeah, I did. <laughs> Once you're done, this is what it looks like. Um, and I'm pushing it to the side and getting my second pan. I also forgot to mention that you guys can make this um, little piece as tall as you want. Like you can do three pieces tall, five pieces tall, um, one piece tall, like it kind of really depends on how much stuff you need to hold. Um, you could use this for jewelry or for makeup. Um, I already have one for jewelry so I'm just going to make this one for makeup since the old one I have is really small. So this is going to be my bigger one. And yeah, just continue on. This is optional but while the paint is still wet, what I'm going to be doing is just sprinkling on just a smidge of bit of glitter, of pink glitter. Um, just a little bit, not too too much, nothing crazy. You know how I love, love glitter, but like, I don't want to add too much, but this is an optional, this is optional, I meant, just paint, just add it when the, when the paint is still, um, wet. So I forgot to mention that this color looks really blue on camera, it is really like a turquoise kind of color, so what I'm going to be doing is just taking my hot glue gun, I actually had to switch hot glue guns because the other one, which was my new one, was actually driving me crazy and wasn't even working, which I is ridiculous so I have to take my old one and I'm just hot gluing it down and then taking my candlestick oh sugar I have to put it around the candlestick hold on um apparently you gotta put it around the candlestick not bad and then hot glue it down learn from my mistake <laughs> what I'm doing is just taking my hot glue gun and putting it on the top of my candlestick and then what I'm doing is just finding the middle of it um and then Gluing it down. Is that the middle? No, it's not, but you know what? Whatever. And there you go. Done, you can fill it up with all your makeup, and that's it. You're done.